For the battle is not yours, but God's. That's great. The battle is not yours. He's saying, it's my battle. It's my universe. You're my people. It's my burden, not yours. If you belong to God, your problems belong to God. If you belong to God, you never fight your own battles. You fight his battles, and he fights yours. Think of it that way. If you have battles, it's an honor because they are the Lord's battle. He wishes to share with you victory. His victory. The battle is, remember that, no matter what's going on, the battle is the Lord's. The battle is the Lord's. The battle is the Lord's. And lastly, verse 16. Tomorrow go down against them. Behold, they will come up by the ascent of Ziz, and you will find them at the end of the valley in front of the wilderness of Jeruel. You need not fight in this battle. Station yourselves. Stand and see the salvation of the Lord on your behalf. O Judah and Jerusalem, do not fear or be discouraged. Tomorrow go out to face them, for the Lord is with you. What does God say? And we're going to see the conclusion of this, which is awesome, on Sunday. But here he says, Tomorrow, go down. You need not fight. Too many of us are fighting when we don't have to. The, the wrong fight. God says, I will fight. Still go down. Face the enemy. Face the enemy. Head on. Fight. The Lord wants to share his victory. The Lord will fight. But you have to be there. He's saying, don't run from the problem. Face your problem with the Lord. Stand. Station yourself. Deal with it. Confront it. I'll be in back of you. I'll be in front of you. God will do it, but give him the opportunity to do it. If they weren't there, they wouldn't see it. It wouldn't be their victory. You, he says, go out in the battlefield, not so you can fight the battle, but so I can do it, and you'll get the blessing. They had no idea how, Lord. The armies are coming. doesn't sound like much of a strategy. Go down and stand. No, no weapons, no anything. Wow, that's gonna, there, you, see where the, you see where the fight is? It's not there. The fight is with their faith. That's where the fight is always. Go down with no, no weapons. You don't, don't do it your way. Trust me. Stand. It says in the scripture, having done all, stand. Very important to stand in the Lord. When you're in persecution, just stand. When the trouble is breaking, don't panic, stand. When all hell is breaking loose, stand. Stand strong in the word. Stand strong in faith and in hope, in peace. Stand. One of the biggest things about warfare is just stand in God. And move ahead boldly. They had no idea how. Jehoshaphat bowed his head with his face to the ground. And all Judah, the inhabitants of Jerusalem, fell down before the Lord, worshiping God. And the Levites from the sons of Kohathites and the sons of the Korites stood up to praise the God of Israel with a very loud voice. Right there, he's given everything he needs for victory. And so you too tonight. Grab hold of what you need to apply in your life. You will have problems. Don't panic. You do have to fight the good fight, not your fight. When you're in the middle of a problem, turn your attention to God. Get your eyes on God. Don't be used by your problem. Learn how to use your problem to get closer to God. First thing to do, pray. Remind God of his goodness. Remind yourself of his faithfulness. Stand in your standing. Stand on the promise. Your power is limited. God is not. It's okay not to know what to do. Just keep your eyes on God. God is the answer, not the problem. Therefore, you must be focused on the answer, not the problem. Bring everything to God. Don't fear the battle, God says, is not your battle. It's my battle. Let me fight it. But you need to go down. Go down. Face your problem head on. Give God the chance to bring victory. Having done all, stand. And last but not least, you want victory. I said it before, it's true. Move your butt. No matter what the problem, but God, but God, but God. No matter what it is, but God. That's what this whole book is, but God. We were falling apart, but God. Therefore, face the enemy, stand, you will be victorious, for the Lord says, the battle 
belongs to him.